Hi 210 students, this is your bi-weekly update. We just finished weeks one and two. I really enjoyed getting in there and reading those quiz questions and hearing your thoughts and your really creative ways to promote critical thinking and cultural diversity in the classroom. I love that many of you mentioned meeting the needs of all your students, meeting them where they're at and valuing them for who they are. So I think everybody is off to a great start. Those are the two foundational understandings, critical thinking and cultural diversity for this class. And as we move forward, we will split those into smaller segments and look at them more closely. So as we go into weeks three and four, you're going to learn about uh, gender and also about ethnicity and race. And there is a lot of information in Canvas over the next two weeks for you to go through. A lot of links, a lot of graphs, a lot of videos. So hold tight. This is a busy next two weeks. Not every two weeks has this much information. You'll also find an optional set of information um, with regard to both of those topics. So if you chose for your major research project to do anything related to gender or race and ethnicity, you are more than welcome to use any of the things in there with your project. But I do encourage you if you have time, a lot of them are really great and I struggled with whether or not to make them um, required or optional, but there's just so much good information out there that I had to pick and choose. So if you, if you don't have time right now to do it, save those links or plan to go back at another time when it's not so busy in this class because they are really worthwhile. Um, in addition to the chapter two and four quizzes, which once again will come from, the questions will come from your textbook and from the reading and watching and any other material in Canvas. So be sure you go through all of that before submitting your quiz, which isn't timed and you should be able to go back in and finish it. Um, you should have more than one shot to get that done. So don't stress out if you're feeling a little overwhelmed midway through, take a break, look at your material again and go back to it. I don't want it to be something that you guys stress out about or feel like I'm tricking you. It's just simply to know that you've covered the information. Um, in addition to those two quizzes, you'll have a Brown versus a Board of Education reading and um, assignment to do. And we will begin other people's children and you will start discussing that in the discussion board area. So I look forward to seeing you all in the discussion board area and we'll check back in again in about two weeks, specifically around um, the 19th of September when all of this stuff is due. So be sure it's on your calendar so you don't lose track and I'll be talking to you soon.